Trust me, there's been a lot going on. There's been a lot of changes and I've been very busy, you know. So here you have it. As you read by the title of this video, this is my seven month update with CRST. So I just want to get right into it. You know, I gotta be quite honest with you guys. I haven't even been with CRST. So from the last video I posted, which was about the CRST pay raise, I wasn't even working with CRST then. I had switched over to another company, and from then to now, I've been with the same company. So I say I probably was only with CRST for about a month and a half after completing my CDO training with them. I only worked for them for about a month and a half. Now, I'm gonna get into the details of why exactly I left CRST and what made me stop working with them as a company in another video and I'm also going to make I'm also going to you know explain my contract and what happened when I broke the contract with them but in this video you know I just want to give you guys an update and you know seven months has, has been a long time of me driving trucks but as you see I'm still at it I'm still with it I'm hanging in there um, still over the road but my route it's a little bit more easier than it was with CRST, you know, CRST used to send me all over the place, you know, I never know where I end up, I just wake up and finish a load and boom, another load going somewhere random, where I'm at now, you know, I have certain locations that I visit and I frequent the same places, so I never necessarily don't know where I'm going because it's pretty much a network of the same places that I'm going to, um, and I enjoy that a lot better, so when I first started off with this company, I was actually going um, from Los Angeles to the East Coast. So like New York or New Jersey, either one of those places. And then I would head back to Los Angeles uh, once a week. As of right now, I'm actually in Anthony, Texas. I love in Anthony, Texas, um, right outside of El Paso. Right now I'm on a route with this company where I go from Los Angeles to Dallas um, or Los Angeles to Houston and back. And I do that a few times a week. Um, I'm still team driving. I'm not solo driving just yet. I've done one solo trip um, throughout this entire journey of me truck driving, but I'm still team driving and I'm team driving with a friend again, a um, good friend of mine. So, you know, again, like I always say, and like I said in the last video, when you're driving with a friend, you know, you guys have to respect each other's spaces and you know, it's a lot easier to get along with a friend than it is with a stranger because you pretty much already know your friend. You guys have a lot of fun, you know. When I'm when me and my friend are out here on the road, we experience a lot of different things, and you know, it's, there's a lot of laugh, laughter, a lot of jokes, uh, a lot. It, 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 there's a lot of memories that are being made here on the road because we see so much different stuff. Sometimes, you know, if we have time, we can pull over, stop, and go experience different things that we probably would have never seen if we would have just been home working a regular job. So, you know, truck driving, you definitely get the experience of everything out there in the world, or not everything, but you know, you, you definitely get experience of everything out there here in the US and all these different states that you visit. But getting back on topic, guys, I would never get on the internet, get on YouTube and bash CRC as a company. You know, I see a lot of YouTubers uh, make videos that bash CRST and, and say negative things about them. And I can say I enjoy my experience with CRST and I am truly grateful for the opportunity that CRST gave me um, by you know helping me get my CDL, by the training um, that they provided for me, the resources and the opportunity to be able to drive with a friend at that point in time when I was with CRST. You know, I don't necessarily have anything negative to say about CRST. Uh, everybody has their reasons for why they leave a company. And my reasoning isn't because of anything necessarily negative, but I just had better opportunities that were presented to me. And I would recommend to anybody that it doesn't matter where you work, if you have other opportunities presented, that are going to be better or that you feel are more beneficial to you in your life, go ahead and go for it, you know? These big companies, they'll be around. CRST and 
all those other big companies, they'll be here. So if you wanna take a leap of faith and try something else out, go ahead and do that, you know, because at the end of the day, if things don't work out the way you're expecting them to work out or the way you think it's gonna work out, you can always go back to one of these companies. So don't be scared to, you know, go out on a leap of faith and try something new, which is exactly what I did. I had an opportunity presented my way um, and I went ahead and, and accepted that opportunity. Now, of course, any job, any company, they're not gonna want you to leave and they're gonna tell you that, you know, oh, it's not gonna be what you expect and blah, 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 you know, that may be true to a certain extent and that may be true for certain people. For me, in my situation, what I was expecting is exactly what I got, which is why I'm still with the company that I'm with. Um, I don't necessarily have plans on leaving this company anytime soon. You know, it's a very good company. The pay is very well. I get treated very well. So, you know, um, it's not a bad experience with them either, you know, but I would recommend, like I said to anyone, CRST is a very good company and they're definitely good for beginners, definitely good for rookies if you don't have much experience or if you don't have any experience at all and you're just trying to get started in truck driving, go ahead and go with CRST. You know, like I said, they help you get your CDL. They give you a lot of resources. The training is pretty good. Um, so, you know, it's definitely good for, for, for beginner drivers. Now, I wouldn't necessarily say the same for an experienced driver. Personally, even going off of the pay scale, which I made a video of, um, there are other companies where if you're an experienced driver, you can definitely make a lot more money than you would be making with CRST. Um, so I probably wouldn't recommend that to someone who's an experienced driver, but most of the people who watch my videos aren't experienced drivers. A lot of you guys are either not truck driving and just interested in getting into truck driving or people with very little experience truck driving so like i said CRST is a good company for those beginners you know uh, but that's all i really have to say on my on my seven month update with crst like i said seven months and i'm no longer with crst i was only with them for about a month and a half um i will be making another video that will go into detail on exactly why i love crst and I'll also be sharing my contract with you guys and what happened when I broke the contract with CRST because I know that that's a question a lot of people have. But if you guys do have any questions that you would like for me to answer, go ahead and you know drop them in the comments down below. I'll try to get to as many questions as possible and answer them thoroughly. You know, But until next time, guys, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe so I can keep these videos coming for you guys.